Peter, the mother of 18-year-old Martine Martinez, says her son is doing well tonight. Now, he's recovering after being shot in the head just 48 hours ago. Martine's mother tells us how she and her family are keeping it together during this tough time. It's a story you'll only see right here on News Channel 5. I don't got much. I just have my kids. The life of one of those kids was nearly taken by a bullet after two gunmen showed up at the front door, fired, and fled. My 60-year-old just said, hey, Martin just got shot. Martin and I just jumped up. With her terminal illness keeping her confined to bed, this 39-year-old mother of four watched as her children rushed to their brother as he fell to the ground. My daughter is outside with calling 91. And Javier got him up and uh, tried to keep him awake. Martin is recovering here. His mother says doctors are keeping him sedated. He's scheduled to go in for surgery for doctors to remove that bullet in the next few days. Does he know what happened? No. What, what do you say to him? What is he I just talked to him and tell him that his old family's here, and, and I tell him I hold his hand and say, if you can hear me, squeeze it. And he squeezes it. As her son fights to recover, Anita says her family is fearful, with the gunmen still at large. I do pray that they do catch them, whoever did this. This situation that's left a mother asking why. <laughs> Police are still looking for the suspects responsible for the shooting and are actively investigating the case. Now, we'll bring you any new information as soon as it becomes available. Peter, back to you.